Hey guys, welcome back to Coyote Creek 2. This is Master Control Facility. There's a door here. We're not going to go through that just yet. You can come across to here. Winchester. Uh -huh. I've done if you already have it, which you probably should at this point. No count this has ammo, so the best way to get back is to just jump and jump off here. There's another box over this side. With some more bizarre ammo. Uh -huh. Uh, yes, we are going to come back down here at the very end. But let's go through here now. Oh, the other side. And that puts us up here. Here's the door. There's a door there. If you look here, on the side, you can see some numbers, some dice, 6182, remember that. So you want to come through here now, there are some flames, so it's a good idea to save. So this is just a fight on the escalator here. Most of these will go on and off, but they don't all do it. So as soon as this one goes off, run past it and be careful of this other one. The one to the left of us now does not turn off. And this one in front of us does not turn off either. All the others turn on and off. And as soon as it goes off, run past it. If you look up there you can see oh. a tire you can shoot out for a secret. So let's just jump and pad up. You can jump really high with that thing. This is the first secret of this level. So I'm going to save it here. And so we got your big charts. Ooh, careful of the steam, and you notice what toxic gas meter. You can head back out this area to avoid it. When you shoot all four of these things, and the toxic gas will disappear. So this is the place where we enter 
Oh, I forget the code. Six one eight two. There's also a button that will show it to you, which is very useful. Don't open the back door. Yes, you can type it in using the uh, key, the numbers on your keyboard, or you can use the arrow keys. And be careful of this, because this will still you know, make you jump high. And if you jump into any of the other two, the other three tiles there, that, that is, they are burner tiles. The flames come back on. So when the first one goes off, sprint. And this time I'll just keep taking little steps forward. When this flame goes off, it's, you know, I tend to run over to here. Oh, sprint, sprint, sprint. Done. So you can head back out of here now. This is the door that we opened. Press the button. That's going to open up that door. However, we need to uh, activate a teleporter. So place the alien ore. We got this a very long time ago. Put this back up in uh, level three and level four. Don't step on the actual thing. Place all four alien ores. And if you jump onto here, I will turn to gold. It's pretty cool. So I had to do it at least once. Anyway, pick up the gold bars. Careful, I think these tiles, the pipes here will do damage. A lot. Let's test that theory. No, they won't. There are pipes like this that will do damage later on. So once you've got the gold bars, this opens. And the teleporter will now be active as well. Behind this door. You can also head into here. Nothing special in here, just some pickups. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. There's a little trick here to these burners. If you just hug the uh, left wall, she will not stay, take any damage. Anyway, you're going to end up up here. There's a secret, there's two secrets in this room, but I'm going to grab them in a minute. There's a door here, which we're going to go through. You can see some spikes. Oh. Get rid of the uh, things, guarding the levers. Pull the switches. And do it again. And do the same thing on the other side. 
As soon as you pull this, uh, that's going to deactivate that. These robots that come out. Uh -huh. So there's, these robots aren't that tricky to deal with. There's also a box over here, and I don't want to use them. There's a small medipack inside. Uh -huh. So yes, yeah, so you can head out now. And let's grab the secrets. The first one is up here. There's one ahead of us and there's one below us. So yes, there's two secrets now that we're going to grab. Open up this. Shoot out the box and run and jump and grab. Push this forward. Inside here, there are some more patrol guns. Because we've already got them, it's ammo. Yeah, because I think it was for a secret last time as well, so yeah. Oh. So you don't have to uh, grab it. But it would come in really useful if you do. Also for the next secret. There's another muddy pack here. Not the secret. There's a ladder leading down. Let's find some grenades. The grenade gun itself. And the very fuck. To get back up, just press this button. You'll be teleported. I'd like to save before doing this and grab out the, the V pistol. Where are you? Okay, that's all of them. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Pick up the uh, items that you can see. No. I 
Okay, so there's one guy dropped an item on the trap. Now oh, that, you can't get it now. It's so that one's going to have to stay there. Uh -huh. So never mind. Like I said. We're getting close to the end now, so we don't need the uh, stuff anymore. There's also, n I don't think there's anything upstairs either. So I'll pull this block to where the button is. So you can press it. the button open the doors you can save here because this bit is quite tricky come on okay I'll take it Let's head into here and press this button. We've got a fly away. Showing you what it does. Thump. So let's we'll open up that door, which is timed. Let's save again. <laughs> I know I saved too much, but the old me would have definitely saved between each bumper there. There's some more grenade ammo here for you. VP. So I've got did much better with uh, the VPM ever than I did in my first attempt at recording this. <laughs> so he just exploded himself on that power there. There's more barrels in here. <sighs> so you can walk through and not touch them, but it's much easier to do that. So if you don't have big grenade you're going to have to walk through the whole thing without touching a single one of them. Oh, quickly, quickly, quickly. So yes, yeah. there's also a uh, medipack. Uh -huh. Let's just grab the item that we need to grab, so I don't need to grab it, but there's a few items in this area. 
Another small medikit. Which we've got plenty of, by the way. Okay, I've got these bowels. Oh. Okay, so it's just back here. So let's grab this medipack again. Head back into here. And grab the flares. Careful. Almost some more blood. I'm ready packs in there. So let's grab the uh, maybe if I can move on. Go to the other side. These bars are the yellow will set you on fire so don't just touch them. Push this block forward. Yes, let's go forward and shimmy around this thing. That's a uh, no one of those escalator monkey bars. I guess it is making me move a bit, a bit faster, which is useful. Just so want to get close to this flame and drop down. Jump and grab a lever. And it'll show you that door. I know there isn't a... Uh... Let's get rid of these boxes first. More grenades. And more bachart stuff. Alright, let's switch to the volcanic pistol. Press the button. I need lots of many pack. So push this button in. Gotta move you across. Careful of the uh, fire thing. There's nothing down here this time. Uh -huh. You can grab the medipack and uh -huh. the ammo and head up. Oh, 
I'll grab your footing and jump back. Careful. I'm safe for doing this because gotta find a sweet spot. Too far. Find a sweet spot you can just side jump. Same here. And if you wanna come over to the middle of this one. Those lasers will hurt you. Do not slump into the lasers, not careful. So, jump over here. Jump, run forward, jump between. Now for this one, just to be safe, you can crouch under the first one. I flip over the second one. Uh -huh. Small medifac. I don't think there's anything in this water. It's just here to put yourself out. Let's leave this area now. And let's head on up again. So press this button to move the cavity again. As you can see, this is the last. There's no button to move it again. So it's the last time. And as always, I don't think there's anything. Nope. But it's well designed though. So I pull this block out. Load this tile. I'll show you that door opening. This one here. If you jump and grab it, you have to jump back immediately. And the other one you, you pretty much can't pull. I don't think you're meant to pull that one I just pulled, but it doesn't do anything, I don't think. I've not found a purpose for it. <laughs> so you can come into here now. This is a different carriage and push this one. It's not quite a long one, so... Uh, I also know of some more robots, but I can't figure out how to get there, so I don't think you can. Same with this one. So there's only... There's a no more volcanic piss over here if you need it. Uh -huh. Another small body pack. Uh -huh. Let's 
that it is safe before coming in here. Jump over the beam. You can see a skeleton coming after you. He can kill you in one hit. But you can't kill him. So, yes. Hopefully this one... Uh, come on. Push this back all the way in here. It's quite a long push, but don't stop always. That guy will get you. Then you can use a flash to stop him. Now how our targets this thing. Oh. I'm gonna away from the sky. That's the end of the uh... Oh, grenades, that's just... Oh, is Okay, so I can grab this without him. So I'm gonna try and lure him away now. for him to come up here because there's a pick up if that one of the guys dropped so yes that's pretty good enough he moves quite slowly there's someone who's really powerful that is so I put the alien orb key in the alien orb key hole I guess and come to here Who, who are you? What are you? Why do you disturb me, mortal? My name is Lara. You can call me Keller. I am the one behind the mystery of Coyote Creek. I am the one responsible. You are an Atlantean? I am from a far superior race. Can't you see that, mortal? You know nothing of our past. Then enlighten me. In times long gone, our race opposed Atlantis. Our two mighty races fought each other. Great battles scarred the Earth. I still hear the echoes from those days. Then your race built all these machines? Yes, to fight and corrupt the Atlanteans. I became a god to the tribes here, wearing this mask to cover my features. I made them construct all of these structures and war machines in my name. 
Natla and the Atlanteans, you made them fight each other. But the tribes realized who you were, and they trapped you, didn't they? You still had access to the machine, and the gold is still corrupting, so you desperately reached out to others, so their greed could set you free. The native tribes, the conquistadors, the miners and others, their spirits remaining trapped here by you. Yes, but you have now set me free with the others failed. You are powerful, and only someone of great strength and spirit could have made it this far. Join me as my champion, and you will see more glories by my side. Never. It's over, Keller. How right you are. I don't want to say it again, because this is Keller, and he is an absolute Whack. <laughs> so place your gold bars here. He will he will be shooting at you constantly. But thankfully here in the middle there is a health station. Which makes the whole game a lot easier. Jump and jump again. There's another gold bar. Good. Yeah, you can use the half station. Come to this side. Be quick about one because it will the fire trap. Don't come up here. Oh now he wants to come out of play. This one's a much easier because it's in the Oh Yeah, that's a bit too uh Yes, this one's not the club later. So I'm waiting for the spikes to come up. And place your final gold bar here. We destroy all the uh, machines in this area and blow up Keller, but it's not dead yet. Also, uh, <laughs> you can use this half station again, I think. This will teleport you back out of here. I shall not be denied victory. You can grab the secrets as well if you uh, want them. Put up, turn, drop, and let go. I'm on the wrong side. I might want to come over to here. Wait for the flame. Come flame. More flames to wait for. Now I'm going to head down. Tell the rough is uh, being a bit horrible, but once you're down here, you can jump. Down to this side. Careful of these 
Primes. Let's have to be careful, Lava. Easy thing to do is just to jump over to here and avoid the flames. You want to run and jump over to the other side. Pull up, shimmy. Let go. Don't know what I'm saving. Okay, and we're almost out of here. to here Kello will get trapped in the thing so you can just type in 2012 as it says there press enter Kelly Okay, I think I did that too early. And I didn't. Why tell me to do it again? I'm gonna step through the teleporter here. I'll be back in uh, Curve to Creek, so I'll see you guys in the next part. Take it easy.